Hi doll fam, welcome back to my channel. Remember that my channel is not made for kids and it is solely for the adult collectors and for the adults who want to purchase these products for their kids. Alright everyone, welcome to my new setup. It's still a work in progress, but how do you like this setup compared to my other one? So this one is in my room. That last video was also in my room where I did the Disney IOI dolls. That was also in my room, but now this is a different angle because I did get a new shelf and I did want to showcase some of the dolls that I do own. So let me know what you think about the shelf because I personally like it and I like seeing the dolls like in the background and everything. And of course, I still do have like the table here. It still spins and we can still showcase the dolls and go through them. Just let me know what you think in the comments down below. Today we are reviewing the LOL OMG sports dolls. Not a big fan of sports, but I do like the Olympics. The Olympics is the only sport I like besides drag race, which is the sports of drag, which I love. But this line is so cute. There's two dolls so far. It, it does feel kind of out of place. I think they kind of did it to coincide with the Olympics, but these dolls just came out of nowhere and they're they're cute though, I like them. And I have looked at them, but of course I haven't taken anything out yet. I'm doing that with y'all. But let's get into the packaging. So this particular packaging is the LOL OMG Sports. And I'm gonna make sure to review these packagings really well because I'm gonna start throwing them away, which is really sad, but I am gonna cut out the artworks on these packaging so I can keep those. So her name is Cheer Diva. And she's kind of giving me an Ariana Grande cheerleader vibe. Thank you, next moment. So you see her artwork right here. There's the logo for sports. It says 20 surprises. And I like the gold and everything on here. It has like little black pom-poms on a white background right here. Then on here it does say cheer diva with a megaphone and pom-poms. On this side it does say the hey sis and it has a trophy and her little sister. I want her little brother. It, he's adorable. He's really cute. And on the back we have the other queen which is Vault Queen and we have Cheer Diva on the back. And it says, OMG, we sisters are here to win. The competition is fierce, but so are we. With the heart of a champion and the strength of a queen, we always surprise the world. I love how LOL phrases everything. I just adore them. So these I got at Target. I think they've been out for a little while and I just wanted to review these because I own every single LOL OMG and that's not going to stop anytime soon. I really do like them and I do use their clothing a lot for my rainbow high doll so they're multifunctional. Alright, let's start opening her. So if we slide this open, we get Miss Cheer Diva, y'all. And over here, we get a panel of her artwork, which is beautiful. Definitely keeping that. And it says, I spell victory with an O-M-G. And I love her artwork and her pose. I wish they can bend at the knee. But I do like the rubbery knees with them. And here she is. Let's open her wardrobe where it says, strut your stuff. And here she is, y'all. Mine's face looks really good, but I think the hair is a little bit messy and we'll get into that. I really do like her and the colors of her packaging and everything. I tried kind of to match her with like the pink and the blue of the shirt. Y'all know me, I always try to match the doll. I will see you guys in a bit once I fully take out everything and put it on this Lazy Susan. I'll see you soon. And we're back. All right, so let's start with the actual doll and everything that she came with on first. First, she did come with a stand that's silver. It's just a plain silver stand. There's nothing special. It's the bigger stand. And, you know, it's just the standard stand. And you get more clips with this doll. For what reason? I don't know. The only thing I can come up with is that they're doing that kind of like Legos where they give you more clips in case you are more likely to lose them. That's the only thing I can come up with. So let's look at the doll just without any of her accessories on. Her hair came very, very messy, y'all. Here she is. I do like the pom-poms and I love her face. It's pretty clean. I think there was like one smudge over her eye, but it's really not that bad. She has nice brown eyes. I love the freckles and I like the little stars and I like the eyeshadow shape of the wing liner and I love the little stars. She's really cute. For her hair, the top is where it looks the best compared to the bottom, it's still a mess. I love that this is not a bow, this is actual hair, and it's molded onto this ponytail that she has, it's very intricate. So it is a high pony, all pulled up top, and then the sides is all the way down with these bundles with different colored rubber bands that alternate from blue to pink. 
and it does get messier as you go down the bundle. Do you guys see that? It gets messier and messier, so I'm gonna have to undo this and have to brush out her hair because this, this ain't it, sis. This ain't it. Quality control, where are you at? Because this hair is a mess. And usually I don't do LOL's hair, LOL doll's hair because it does come pretty nice, but this one did not. She's proving that wrong. So she did come with pom-poms. This one is silver and pink. It has a handle that goes on her hand right there, and it just sits on there nicely. She does have no polish. Let's look at that for everything else. And it's that blue color, periwinkle color. Then the other one is that periwinkle color with silver as well. Both of her hands have the same nail polish. Then for her outfit, she has this cute top that's kind of like a bralette or a sports bra. And it, I like all these strings on it that go around it. It's the periwinkle with silver straps and a white base to the bottom of it. Then I love her shorts a lot. So they have cutouts on the sides to where you could see her thighs. I love that so much. The top is pink and it's that periwinkle and on the side it has that like sports mesh with some hot pink on the trimming of it. It's really cute. Then she has these cute little socks that are very tall and definitely gonna steal these for Bella. But they're very cute and they're pink. I like the color of them. She looks already ready to cheer. I cannot wait to put everything else on her. Let's start delving into those accessories. Let's start with her gym bag. Yes, it does say gym bag on here and it's a hot pink and black. Let's open this. And here is her gym bag, y'all. Oh my gosh, this is actually pretty intricate. So it's a definitely a new mold. It has a pink strap and the purse itself opens. This is so cute. I love the buckle on it that's pink and with the white. It's all plastic, like a rubbery, you know? It's kind of like a rubber material, so it's very moldable. And it is periwinkle as well, and it opens, and you can put stuff in there, which is so cute, and I like the multifunctional use on it. And you can remove these straps, which this is giving me ideas for stuff, but it's really cute. I like this. All right, let's go on to the large Carmen bag, which is just this periwinkle pattern with her color scheme with pink and white color on there. And it is a pink handle. And we have her jacket, y'all. And here's the jacket. It's really cute. It's a nice material. Is it? Be careful. Oh, I'm not sure if this is supposed to be like this. But there's pockets on here and i thought it was broken but i guess she could put her hands in there it's a really nice jacket the zipper i think it's almost metal but it might just be painted to look like metal and it's actually chrome and shiny the base of the jacket is white the sleeves are pink and they go into stripes of periwinkle and white and they're cuffed in white then up top the color is periwinkle it does say omg right here and this other sleeve is the same and at the bottom, it's also cuffed in periwinkle. And I do like the added pockets on here. On the inside, it has, I think this is called interfacing to make it stiffer. I think that's what that's called or just a mesh layer on there. Either or, it's one of those. Next is this garment bag and it has stripes and the base is baby pink and it has her color scheme, the periwinkles, the whites, and that other like magenta color. Is this a skirt? Oh my gosh, this feels very light. Wait, is this a skirt? I'm really curious to see what this is. How do we take this off? Oh, we need to undo that. Oh my gosh. So I undid whatever this is. I do not know what this is. It's not on the packaging. We'll look into that in a little bit. All right, so here is this thing. No idea what this is. I'm gonna have to go look at people's pictures, but this is a nice, whatever this is, I'm thinking it's a skirt or that's the only logical thing I can think of, but it's a very light material. Like it literally weighs like a feather. It's so light and it's not trimmed or anything. And it's a hot pink color, kind of magenta-y. No, honestly, it's a fuchsia color. It's fuchsia and it's kind of looks crackly. It's really cute and it has a lace on there. No idea what that is. She did come with a little booklet that says all-star cheerleading and it says cheer diva, favorite move, toe touch, back tuck. We love a good tug. And it says fave section, pyramid. And it says world champ, second place winner, and cheer first. Oh, that's cute. So those are all like the trophies she's won. 
Then on the back it says core and the her total points were dance 10, tumbling 10, jumps 10, and pyramids 9.5. So it, I like that it does show that she's not perfect. It does show that she's good at what she does, but she's not perfect. And I love that. We're not all perfect. On the inside, it just says Cheers Championship 2021, and it has her in there. Really cute. I love the sports that they chose for this sports line. And then we also get a comb, which is that same periwinkle color. I love same periwinkle. It's so much fun. Next up, let's do her shoes, which are in here. They are always six and a half. The base is magenta -y fuchsia color, and the top is silver. Ooh, these are each bundled in a different wrapping paper. That's cute. And these shoes are a recolor. So looking at my dolls over here, it is a recolor of Miss Neonlicious. So here's Neonlicious's shoe, and here's the new ones from Cheer Diva. The difference is the base is hot pink for this one, and it does have the laces colored in, as opposed to this one, they weren't colored. So I do like seeing the laces colored for this one. And it does have more paint on there, and it does have the silver that this one does not have. So I do like that it is a little bit different in terms of color, but it's essentially the same mold. And I do like these. I love shoes like these and I would love to own something like this IRL. And lastly, let's do her hat box, which is really cute. The top is hot pink and the base is periwinkle with white stripes. How adorable. Let's get into this one. We get two earrings, which are definitely a, <laughs> the same ones we've gotten before. We've gotten these a lot, actually. In the next little wrapping paper, this time they individually wrapped everything. In this one, you get a medal. Oh, that is so cute. I can't wait to put this on her. This is adorable. In the last wrapping paper, you get a towel? Why do you get a towel? I mean, it's a nice towel, but why do you get a towel? I mean, I guess it's kind of cute. All right, it's time to dress Miss Cheer Diva. I will see y'all in a bit once she's fully dressed. All right, and she is fully dressed. Let's look at her and every accessory. She has a lot going on. And I honestly love that about LOLs, that they always just go all out with them. I totally forgot to show y'all her room. So here's the box. Inside, you get her mirror, of course. And now let's look inside her room. It's actually pretty cute. So you get a locker in here that says Varsity. You get these boots right here that are kind of very Ariana Grande-like. Then on this side, you get a board. I'm trying to show y'all in the light, but it's kind of difficult with the lighting and everything, but it's a board and it does say go team, number one champs with Polaroids. It has a foam finger that says number one. It has Jojo Siwa bows in there. There's balloons up top with like a trophy on this side on top of the locker. Then on this side, it says there's a cheer chair. It has a star light on there as well. So many little details that you just have to get it to look at. And this is a gym bag right here that's pretty cute. And she's fully accessorized. She is adorable. I actually really do like her a lot. I love the combination of all the colors she has together. Like I put her medal on, I had to tie it on in the back. And it's so cute, it's a silver medal. I love how the jacket fits her and I love the bag. The pom-poms are so cute and I love how the shoes go with the socks, how that aesthetic looks. And this is a skirt, I looked at pictures and it's just very, this is the thinnest fabric I have ever felt in my life. I do need to fix her hair like I said because it's a mess, it's a disaster. The quality control could have been a lot better for her, but it could have maybe just been the one I picked. But I don't know. If a kid got this, they might have wanted it better. But I do like the earrings on her and everything. And I do love her aesthetic. And again, I love how LOLs, each one is a different doll. And I really do appreciate that. And she's really, really cute. And she's got her towel to wipe off her sweat or mine. I adore her. She's really cute. I do think she's worth it. If I wasn't a big collector of LOL OMGs, I maybe would have skipped her, but because she does kind of look like Ariana Grande, I do like that about her. And should you get her, if you like the aesthetic and if you're into cheer dolls or into cheer at all, definitely get her. If you're kind of on the fence with her, I would say maybe skip her. There's more LOLs coming soon that I think might be better. I do think she's really cute for what she is and I'm glad she's in my collection because like I said, I'm still gonna get 
all the OMGs that I can. Anyways, I hope you all like this video. Comment and subscribe. Let me know all your thoughts about her in the comments down below and what you think of my new setup. And make sure to hit that bell notification so you're notified of my next video. I will see you next time and I hope you all have an incredible rest of your day. Bye!